The warned dentition, who should attend? I think one of the things that challenges a lot of our doctors is when we really get into that additive option. And when we look at wear or erosion, first of all, understanding why teeth wear down and why teeth erode and how that ultimately affects the occlusion is extremely important. So if the doctors are seeing that and they're confused about what to do, this, this course will teach them again how to apply the principles we've ta taught them to the cases where they need to alter vertical dimension. The other thing we spend time on is, which is challenging certainly for all of us, but if we have to open a bite, it does mean a lot of dentistry, but we're gonna teach transitional bonding techniques where they can open the vertical dimension with resin, whether we do it directly in the mouth or do it on models or mill restorations, resin restorations. We're gonna teach a variety of ways to do that. So we can take basically 28 unit cases and convert them into really six or 12 unit cases up front, which then allows us to finish the posteriors over time. So if the doctor is wanting to solve these problems, are looking for ways to um, be able to segment or sequence quick cases where we're not sacrificing on any bit of quality at the end, this is the, the course for you. Upon completing this course, they'll master, they'll really understand the different causes of wear and be specific, have specific understanding of what they should be addressing in the occlusion to be able to get that done. Um, they will also understand transitional bonding techniques where they can either do it directly in the mouth, do a direct indirect technique where they're making little onlays on uh, diagnostic casts, uh, and writing, even writing prescriptions to mill little tops that could go on there. These techniques along with um, strategies to prepare a whole arch at one time and make processed acrylic temporaries, these are all the, the, the techniques that become extremely important as you start to approach different ways to do full arch dentistry. How will that uh, affect the practice or help the practice? Well, being able to do large case dentistry and certainly wear uh, is one of those things where uh, if you get good at doing this, your productivity per hour will be through the roof when you're working on these cases. So we're gonna positively affect the bottom line. But most importantly, we're also gonna teach you how to um, solve a lot of these functional problems related to wear, which is also going to make restorations more stable and last longer and decrease the chance of fracture and remakes and all those things. So that generally makes dentistry a heck of a lot more fun, makes it more profitable, uh, and that's kind of win-win inside the dental practice.